Lenovo confirms the existence of GeForce RTX 3060, RTX 3050 Ti and RTX 3050 graphics cards. There's nothing like starting the year with good technical news, is there? So let's talk about the products in the hardware segment, i.e. NVIDIA graphics cards. After many powerful devices introduced by the California manufacturer, now 4GB GeForce RTX 3050 graphics, 6GB RTX 3050 D and 12GB RTX 3060 appeared on the Lenovo list. Before starting with this make sure you subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon so you will never miss our upcoming videos with lots of new products and benchmark comparison. Start with the video. 2020 was a very favorable year for NVIDIA, which was ultimately chosen by our reader's best graphics chip maker. In short, the company introduced powerful graphics GeForce RTX 3070, RTX 3080E and RTX 3090. Then the plate was launched RTX 3060 Ti. But rumors show that there is more equipment in the brand structure and soon, new news may come to us. It is very difficult to, ensure, new equipment until the day of its official presentation. Nowadays, even if it is through, accidental, published leaks or revelations, the news will be stopped quickly before it becomes official. The RTX 3050, RTX 3050 Ti and RTX 3060 appear on Lenovo's list. Recently, 4GB GeForce RTX 3050 graphics card, 6GB RTX 3050 D and NVIDIA's RTX 3060 12GB graphics card were discovered on the Lenovo list. This list is about one of Lenovo's computers in the Legion series, and it includes all three cards not yet announced by NVIDIA. Therefore, it is estimated that the manufacturer will be able to deliver these new printers as part of the intermediate segment by early 2021. According to the website Video Cards, it should come with RTX 3060 GA106-400 chip, 3840 CUDA cores, 30 RT cores and 120 Tensor cores. The capacity of the VRAM memory is estimated at 12GB for the GTDR6 type, which is calculated to be up to 10GB more than the RTX 3080. In turn, the RTX 3050D should have a lower capacity, which includes the GA106-300 chip, 3584 CUDA cores, 28 RT cores and 112 Tensor cores. VRAM memory comes with 6GB of GDDR6. The RTX 3050 is expected to be the most affordable model so any player can rely on the power of an RTX on their devices. This card comes with a GA107-300 chip, 2304 CUDA cores, 18 RT cores and 72 Tensor cores and 4GB of GDDR6 of VRAM memory. Notable for its low consumption, it can be with TBP, it is only 90W. In short, many more news will be announced by the hands of NVIDIA by February. The manufacturer has already confirmed its GeForce RTX Game On event, which will take place on January 12th, where it will host RTX 3080D. There may be something else. Lenovo updated assortment of their Legion gaming desktops, adding to the R specifications as available options the yet unannounced GeForce RTX 3050. RTX 3050 Ti, and RTX 3060 graphics accelerators. In particular, the new items are offered as part of the Lenovo Legion R528 IMB05 gaming system. According to the manufacturer, the GeForce RTX 3050 model is equipped with 4GB of GDDR6 video memory. Graphics card specifications are not provided, Lenovo data contains information on the set of interfaces available on the graphics accelerator. It includes one DisplayPort 1.4a, one HDMI 2.1, and one DVI. According to the manufacturer, the GeForce RTX 3050 Ti model is equipped with 6GB of GDDR6 memory, as well as three DisplayPort 1.4 and one HDMI 2.1. As for the GeForce RTX 3060, Lenovo credits the model with 12GB of GDDR6 video memory, as well as 3 DisplayPort 1.4 and 1 HDMI 2.1. As Resource points out video cards, the GeForce RTX 3060 and RTX 3050 Ti models are based on the GA106 GPU. 
It is very likely, the source indicates, that NVIDIA will unveil the GeForce RTX 3060 and RTX 3050 Ti during the scheduled GeForce special broadcast on January 12. And the youngest model will have to wait a little longer.